It's Lamar Odom sprawled on a bed at the Love Ranch brothel just hours before he was found unconscious. The exclusive photo obtained by the DailyMail.com was taken at 11.30 p.m. last Monday. Odom is inside the VIP suite where he partied with prostitutes and reportedly binged on drugs and alcohol. On the bedside table, you can see candles, baby oil, and a copy of brothel owner Dennis Hoff's raunchy memoir, The Art of the Pimp. Here's another photo taken earlier that same night at 7.30. He already looks strung out. Odom is barefoot, slouched over on a couch, looking exhausted. He's holding a bottle of water. His eyes are barely open. A young woman, presumably a prostitute, is seated next to him. All you can see are her bare legs. When I saw the photos, I just thought, what the heck? Where did these come from and how did they get them? Brothel owner Hoff says he believes the photos were taken by the women Odom partied with, Monica and Ryder. I put both of these girls on suspension uh, until we find out exactly what happened. Ryder's real name is Courtney Cannon. She's a 25-year-old single mom from South Carolina and is said to be one of the brothel's top earners. Meanwhile, Odom is continuing to show signs of improvement. He was airlifted Monday evening from Sunrise Hospital in Las Vegas to Cedar sinai Medical Center in Los Angeles. When the 6 foot 10 inch tall former basketball star was stricken last week at a Nevada brothel, he was too big for the medevac chopper to airlift him to a hospital in Las Vegas. So how did they airlift him this time? Well, they used a bigger chopper, similar to this Airbus 135, which, as you can see by the tape, is big enough inside to carry a patient over seven feet tall. We spoke to flight physician Dr. Kevin Hutton. Clearly, if somebody's 6'10", that could be a factor in determining whether you can airlift them. It sure could be. In the wrong kind of aircraft, uh, some of the stretchers have to go sideways, so um, it may be very difficult to put somebody that big in. Odom's estranged wife, Chloe Kardashian, rode in the helicopter with him. Speaking out for the first time since Odom's hospitalization, Chloe said, the past week has been incredibly difficult. Incredible strides have been made.